I'm done feeling like like I've been silenced and like I can't speak my truth. Good morning, everyone. Happy Independence Day to all my American friends. Today I am celebrating with my family. Cameron is off work for today and tomorrow. And then of course, you know, Saturday and Sunday. So we get a full four days with him, which is gonna be just wonderful. I feel like I'm so behind because yesterday I was supposed to prep the food for today. I really wanna make my mom's classic 4th of Ju July menu that we always had up at the beach house at my, my grandparents' house up in Whidbey Island. I wanna do her famous potato salad. I wanna do her macaroni salad. And then I think we're just gonna do hot dogs. I wonder if we have baked beans, because we always have those as well. I think we might. But yeah, I was supposed to prep all of that yesterday, and then Cameron had a class that he had to attend, and he didn't realize it was gonna be like a four hour class, so he was supposed to come like watch the kids and take care of them while I was doing all of that, so <laughs> it got really late with his class. And I just was really tired after that. So we're gonna be doing that today. This is what Thor is going to be wearing today. I deliberately got it to try to match my red dress. I'm really hoping to have all of the food ready and chilled and, and finished by the time the kids are up from their nap so we can all get dressed and um, enjoy our, our holiday off. Oh, and before I forget, I do have an announcement regarding my channel, but that's gonna come a little bit later after I've finished everything. I just, I really need to go get that done because the clock is ticking. So we have all the ingredients here, the salad macaroni, celery, yellow mustard, eggs, of course. My mom always makes everything with Miracle Whip, so have to stick to that. Then I found this dill pickle mustard, which is amazing because there's pickles in her potato salad. And then unfortunately I could not find the mini salad tree so I just have small salad shrimp, but I might actually like that more because I really love shrimp. Okay, so now all about the announcement for the channel. There is a lot of stuff that happened throughout my life. It is not currently what I would consider safe to talk about it. And there's a lot of times where I sort of skirt around the topic and then, you know, sort of like a, a read between the lines thing. And then I say, I can't talk about it right now, but someday I will. And I figured out a way that I can talk about it now. I started my channel so I could talk through my grief and sort of use it as an outlet for my grief in, in a cathartic way. And it has been wonderful for that. It has helped me tremendously. And there's just a part of my life that I really want to delve into and discuss. Of course, I want to keep it um, like recovery oriented. There are a lot heavier topics than I feel comfortable making entirely public. I don't want these heavier topics to be just out for anyone to watch. So that being said, I have created a members only content. I think if you're in the YouTube app and you go to my YouTube channel, there's a join button on the right hand side, like um, just under the banner, but you can join. It is a um, subscription based. It's a really low, low subscription though. It would be like two to three extra videos that that everyone else cannot get access to unless they have the subscription. It's it's gonna be like a, like story time videos, things, things of that nature. But yeah, I figure, you know, if somebody really doesn't like me, they're probably not going to pay to, 
to view that content and I'm done feeling like like I've been silenced and like I can't speak my truth does that make sense so that is the the big announcement I am opening up a subscription members only content that will be like two to three extra videos per month and it will be completely different from the vlogs it's it's gonna be just like story time sit down like raw and real stuff me telling my truth and talking about how I how I worked through it and um, how I survived really so if that sounds like something you're interested in feel free to join don't feel obligated to stay if, if it's not your thing, but I would love to see you guys there. Oh, Squawk, you're so handsome. We're gonna have to do some cat cam later after we have some wine, huh? <laughs>